Let's take a moment to go over the closing cost and who pays for what in Nevada. Now, for a cash and conventional um, buyer, you're going to see a lot of the similar, same similar things. Now, with an FHA buyer, there are a couple of things that the seller does pay for. With an FHA buyer, the seller would be paying for the document preparation fee here and then also the tax service contract. You'll go ahead and see that down here on line 22. Um, so those are two things that are different from a cash conventional on FHA. Now the biggest thing with a seller is going to be with a VA buyer, you're going to notice a difference. With a VA buyer, there are just some non-allowable fees that a VA buyer cannot pay for. And that's going to be like a termite inspection. As you could see here, termite inspection, and that can range anywhere from $80 to $120. Uh, property repairs, if there are any repairs that are needed, the buyer is not allowed to pay for that. Discount points, document preparation fee, and we're going to go down to tax service fee right here, line 22. Uh, and then if you go down more, you're going to see that the seller is also responsible to pay for the escrow fee and uh, also the wire fees right here on line 38 and 39 email loan documents. If you have any questions in regards to the closing cost and who pays for what in Nevada, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Some of these fees are negotiable. Um, however, with some buyers, there are some stipulations and regulations that we have to follow. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.